Hello everyone, Storm101 here. Today, welcome back. We're going to be doing some Storm Chasers again today. The second episode, y'all, you guys did enjoy the first one. And uh, if you want to see this series continue, hit that like button. And uh, what we're going to do in this, in this episode is do missions 5 through 8 here. And uh, let me tell you guys a very short story. Um, I did make a video about it yesterday, missions 5 through 8. But the problem was is the OBS did not um, pause the video in a couple of portions of the video. And plus, my words were very sloppy. So the video did not come out today. So I'm going to try it again today. Now, my, hopefully, hopefully, uh, my words would not be that sloppy. It's a pretty bad video. Plus, it was about 15 minutes long. So, yeah, very long. So, let's go, in, go on ahead and get started. And, um, we may have twin tornadoes in Mission 5 here, which is pretty interesting here. At least, it should be interesting. And I failed it last time doing this here pretty badly. I mean, I did pass it, but I did not get a lot of points in it. So, we're going to try it again this time. And I do believe both the tornadoes uh, cross this intersection here. So, we'll place down both of our probes here. The tornadoes do go in a very, very similar direction. It does have some slight different scenarios. But we're going to go ahead and put our probes here nearby the intersection here. Yeah, I remember, I never even got a direct hit on one of these probes here. I missed them pretty bad. So we'll go ahead and place them down. No tornado warning yet, but we do have two storms brewing right in front of us. And we do have a barn as well nearby. So right now, okay, so we do have a tornado warning for this cell right here. Let's see if it hits the barn. It's coming right at us, the storm is. So, yeah, there's our second storm right over here. No tornado warning on that one there yet, but there is a tornado warning on this one here. I do not see any ground circulation yet. As far as I can see here. Nope. Oh, yes, there's some ground circulation right there. So, oh, there's the funnel clad right there. This thing is about to come down. Looks like that's an EF1 tornado. And it's close to the ground. And it's on the ground. Yep. A little bit of a stovepipe tornado. Type of look here. Seems like it's getting strength as well. So, in this scenario here if the tornado has no left to right movement it's heading right towards you and the way I have it, have it centered on the camera here it has a little bit to the right movement so it's not coming straight at us but it is heading right towards the barn looks like we have a tornado warning you have tornado warning in the areas so that's for that cell oh boy it's about to hit the barn Get some good photos out of this here. The story that was really growing for sure. Oh, sure. Oh, any underground circulation around us? About the secondary cell. So. Oh, it's picking up debris. Wait for it to pick up a little bit more. Oh, man. Look at that. We do need to save our photos too because we need to try to get two tornadoes in one photo. Man. 
Oh, the circulation is right there. Okay, let's get out of the way. Get out of the way. We're just about to touch down right here. So let's turn around. Go, truck, go. Oh, boy. Hey, we're really getting pulled into it, too. Wow, that was crazy. Put the truck right here. No funnel cloud yet from the other cell. I don't know if that tornado has. The first tornado did pass the barn. Oh, they're crossing each other. And. Oh, there's a funnel cloud right there. It's very hard to see. Man, that's a very weak tornado. It's not on the ground yet. Man, look at that. It's beautiful. <laughs> and we got two tornadoes on the ground. Mission completed right there. Beautiful. That other tornado is very weak. Getting some good photos out of this. And that's it. Photos. We did score more than 700 points. Right, this story is coming right towards us now. It's about to hit the probes and it is collecting data too. So, yeah, we're about to move out of the way. That's coming just right towards us. We're, we can't really tell where these tornadoes are going. You can see the wind gauge there is kind of a little old. Oh, the other tornado just died. Now this sucker right here is about to take over. It's moving very slow, which gives me, uh, which is concerning for me because you can see the time in the top of your screen. We got a minute and 30 seconds. So, not, it's not really good news, especially if I was moving that slow. But it is, it is getting points, but I really want to have a direct hit. Which seems like it's speeding up a little bit, which is good. That's what we want. Oh boy, it's getting, it's in the circulation right now. It's going to get it. It's going to get, it's going to be very close here. Yeah, I remember last time we only got a little over 800 points, which is not good at all. Oh, it's a direct hit by one of the probes. Let's see if he gets both of them. Yes, it was. Man, that's perfect. I think it's getting close, but it's alright. We'll mess this to the north. Man, we're getting a lot of points, which is good. I wish it's because I wish the time on the should stay a little longer. Or stick around a little longer. We're just getting close. Man, we got a lot of points off that. 2,632. Man, that's good. 12th place. We're killing the leaderboards, man. I'm telling you. We're doing really good. Mission 5 was actually pretty successful. Now, Mission 6 here. It's going to be very interesting here. And also, number 7 on the leaderboards. And I know how to do... I know how to play with this here. And, uh... There's going to be a couple of tornadoes that hits the largest city in the map, which is called uh, Wakoda. There's going to be a small one, and there's going to be a, a large tornado. And you can have two chances of getting three probes in the tornado, at least for the larger one. So I know what to do on here, and I'm going to try to break my record again. 
I'll probably be able to reach top five. And that'd be pretty good if I'm going to be able to. And I'm actually, last time I actually got really close to getting direct hits almost six times. So, so I got three probes this time. I got scored more than 300 points. We also got to drive my vehicle into the tornado. And I think we're going to try to go into a different direction. We're going to head towards right this cell right here. This is the weakest tornado. So... Try to intercept this one here first, and it's already tornado warned. Oh boy, this thing's actually moving fast here. So we gotta hurry up, get to it, try to get uh, my vehicle inside the tornado, because that's one of our objectives. Circulation. I do see a funnel cloud though. Yep, there it is right there. Man, that is beautiful. Let's try to drive into it right now. There's no time to waste. Oh, here we go. And we drove right into it. Sweet. Now we've got to hurry up get those probes into that intersection. So hopefully I can move faster. Those tornado warnings. Uh, the tornado sirens, I should say. Should be going off in Makota right now. right in front of us. Everybody gotta hurry. We gotta hurry. I have too much time for this. And we do have hail, which is not good. I was I in here last time, I know that for a fact. Dude, I got no time to waste. Hurry. Pull up a little bit. Oh, that first one's coming this way. I hurry. My goodness, you can see on the right side of your screen, it's coming. Gotta get out of the way. Both of those tornadoes about to intersect. Intersect. These storms have joined forces here. Let's get into a safe spot here. Take us pick man, that's a monster. Does it look like on radar right now? Oh, they're intersecting right now. I can see it. Man, we're getting a lot of points off of this. Look at them both intersect. That is awesome. And we got a direct hit on one of the probes. And we ran out of storage. That tornado is very okay. That's coming this way. That tornado is very strong. Look at that. It's lifting up the cars. And, oh man. And points left and right. And the tornado just died too. We do have enough time to. Let's kind of wait for the probes to get some more data for us. Alright, let's kick off. Okay, 
160 mile per hour winds. Circulation's right there. In those buildings. Man, some of them probably just got almost got nailed. Here, I got an idea. I got to make this quick though. So one of these probes actually got a direct hit from the first tornado. This has hasn't happened before for me. back up to get the other probe. You gotta hurry up, turn around and get onto that other road. Oh boy, it's getting close. You gotta hurry. Debris flying everywhere. Holy cow. It's like it's guns. Oh. Just ran over a piece there. Jeez. Maybe we might not have enough time. Crap. It's not good. coming right this way. Let's hurry up to the third one down. Uh-oh, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Gotta go. We gotta go. Oh, we're getting holy crap, 150 mile per hour winds. Man, we've been picked up already. If that was the case. Let's see if we can get a direct hit again. Oh yes, we did. Nice. Let's see if we can get any more direct hits on the other probes. Hopefully we can. Slammed by hail right now. I just didn't get there in time. That was pretty unfortunate. The other two didn't get it. They got pretty close. And Revan engine. Excuse me, engine troubles. Oh darn. Hey, we did pretty good this time. Let the probes keep on giving those points here. We might be able to beat our old record. Still picking up points, which is good. Giving those points, I should say. Oh man. This is probably one of my favorite. And there goes our windshield. Hail last time that I know of. So we got 3,884 points. Well, you can see here, seventh place, I got nearly 4,000 points. If I was able to get those other two probes inside the tornado, I would think we would have got more points. It's probably up to sixth place here, if that was the case. But unfortunately, did not. So mission seven, now this is pretty crazy. Mission seven is pretty crazy. So what we gotta do in mission seven is, uh, we have, first of all, we got no vehicle, no probes. All we got is a camera. All we need to do is score more than 300 points, I think, and take a picture of a flying cow. Now this is very dangerous. You can easily get picked up. So there's a tornado outbreak in a small area. 
which means multiple tornadoes are possible in a small area. Basically, what it means. So we gotta be very careful because you can easily get picked up. So, uh, man, they just mayhem the place here. So we gotta be really careful. So there's our cows running in there, even pigs too. So we gotta keep an eye on the sky here. Watch for any ground circulation. We have no radar data either. So, going to watch the skies here and on the ground. See if we got any ground circulation anywhere. Up oh, there's one right there. Another one right there. Oh, tortoise developing left and right. We we'll gotta watch for that one there though. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six tornadoes on the ground right now. Seven. Let's see if any of these tornadoes will get any cows. Oh, there's another one developing back that way too. I'm really keeping an eye on that one. Which it, it may miss us, but we got really got to be careful what we're going to be dealing with here. That one there will probably get the cows, I would imagine. Oh, picked up the tractor. Yep. Didn't get any cows, though. Boy, that's a very large tornado coming this way. That'll be the one right there. They'll pick up all these cows. That tortoise moving away, which is good. Just gotta watch for this one here. That's gonna be coming this way. So let's move out of the way for this tornado to come. Not as bad as last time. Last time there was like five tornadoes spawned in the same field. Right there, right over the cow. So that was a very easy catch. That was insane. Hopefully I can catch a flying cow this time. It's actually kind of difficult than you think it is. That's a probably EF5, EF4 tornado right there. We'll see. Up lag. That's an EF4 coming in. Loud too. Let's keep on running this way. Where's this one here going? With this thing here better not be going to right towards us. That tornado right there. The tornado better be staying away. Alright, here comes this big one. Right here. large tornadoes what we got here. Oh, that other tornado is pick, picking up debris. Can't get too close to it. There's our cows right there. Can we get a flying cow? Come on. Oh man, poor cows over there. Well, that's where it's coming this way. We gotta run this way. Uh oh. Oh, it's picking up cows. There we go. Get all the photos. Yeah, 
and that other tray is like, we're coming this way, we've got to run. I gotta score more than a thousand points here. And we did. Worry though. Just taking pictures left and right right now. Hey, that was pretty good. We almost got sucked up by this one right here, which looks like it's about to die. So we got no other tornadoes coming this way. Which is good news. Still picking up debris though. Just gotta keep an eye on this one here, for sure. Yeah. It's pretty crazy. I did not know this one here was coming. That never even happened to me before. After a few times playing Mission 7. That was crazy. It was pretty crazy. Looks like that tornado should be moving away from us. I mean, we could have been sucked up if we were still standing right there. There's that large tornado moving away. Oh man, the poor cows. Jeez. That was crazy. I'm sure. So we got 1,452 points. Yeah, I got ninth. 2,702 points. Yeah, I think that was the last time when there was like five to six tornadoes in one area, very small area. This one here is kind of difficult to get a lot of points. I'm never going to be reaching 14,321 points, but this is where you could be uh, you could be a tornado, which is very cool. Now, you can play this with other people on multiplayer. The dance about it is there's not a lot of people that play multiplayer on this game here. And uh so yeah, It'll take a while, and they do have Discord, I guess, where if you let someone know if you're going to do a role play, you can let them know on Discord, and they can play with you. I've done that once. Man, that was crazy. But I did get a lot of points, so my team did. It was one person which is Tornado versus four people. Here's our first gas station right here, but we're going to be going to Wakoda to increase our strength here which is the bottom right corner which you can see there that's our category so we need to try to pick up some debris and wherever we pick up a lot of debris that's where you get your percentage to go up in points as well which I'm not gonna be able to get a lot of points on this mission here so here we go easy to pick up some get a lot of points here now we can upgrade to the EF1 tornado which we can pick up some more stuff but this is very cool though just try to get as much points as possible So you will never see we reach EF5 strength. We can pick up so much debris. There's usually like a large, uh, a large clump of debris right in the middle of the tornado. Be EF2. So it's up to that. Boy. Now we can start to pick up those fences and a car. See that car right there. Jeez. Siren's going a little crazy. Alright, we can go EF3. Boy. This is a 
bitch. <laughs> Ripping everyone's houses. But it is fun though. It is. Look at that large clump of debris we got in the middle of the tornado. They get better. Exploded. Jeez, that debris went flying everywhere too. That was crazy. Now keep in mind we gotta pull up two gas stations too. So, yeah. And we're getting a lot of points just by the exploding stuff. Now we gotta move down this way. Just gotta watch the time though. That's everything right now. Here's our first gas station right here. We'll go back to the other gas station. Stop the tornado. We can also start on it again. Man, we are moving so slow. I wish we could move faster. I don't see how those guys got 14,000 points. I just don't see it. Oh, jeez. That's a great, great, great screen there. Gas station. Up oh, with the gas station just exploded. the tornado. What we're going to try to do next is get that other gas station. Let's see how 
how we're dying here. Decreasing in size. Get to some of these houses here while we're at it. Man, we are moving so slow right now. right now I got to say it's very laggy look all the damage we done jeez some of these houses are just yeah look at these houses here they're completely off their foundation man but I still don't see how people got 14,000 points I really do not see it <laughs> to be honest but look how far we've thrown all this debris here almost got to the road Jeez, man. Throw this debris very far. In the tornado, however, from birth to EF5, man, it, it explodes. Let me show you how it gets created from birth to EF5, like in a few seconds here. That big funnel cloud, I mean, just look at that. Pull up two gas stations. Power flashes and stuff. Finish the tornado as well. Let's try to get to this barn here. Watch this tanker truck explode. I'm just waiting for it. We did not make it there. But anyways, guys, hope we got. Oh, oh wait, we got very close to our record. Darn, I thought we did. But anyways, guys, that's our for guys today. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the second episode of Storm Chasers. If you guys wanted to see more Storm Chasers, just hit that like button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.